welcome back to another episode of Wolf Quest. We are here with Ferox and Ren and their five surviving puppies. Um, last episode, we kind of had a tragedy happen. Um, a pair of coyotes came and attacked the site. Um, Ferox was focused on one and the other snuck behind him, slipped past Ren and grabbed Reed as she was still running into the grass. Venus, uh, not Venus, uh, Fauna actually ended up getting lost during that whole or ordeal. It was kind of a crazy night, and everyone now seems to be settling down after those few stressful and tragic moments. Um, little Reed is who passed our little girl, our runt. Um, which is really disappointing. Uh, she came so close to growing up, and we came so close to having a full litter of surviving pups, but I guess it wasn't meant to be this time or the last time, so hopefully maybe third time will be a charm. Looks like everyone's actually going into the grass to sleep, which is great, so... We're now going to go to sleep, have our finger ready on the wolf, just in case if anything else decides to come. Alright, so, yep, only five remain. Uh, Fauna is actually a little bit hungry, so is Sandstone, so we might go out and do, and try to find a fawn or a calf or something. Uh, the territory actually doesn't really look like it needs to be marked. We're gonna be letting these three hexes over here go, um, since we don't live that close to that side anymore. We don't really need to keep those in check anymore. Um, so yeah, we might just go on a little calf hunt, uh, or a fawn hunt, whichever we can find. Um, so, we're just gonna kinda wander around for a little bit and see what we can find. Ren's gonna stay with the pups, and so yeah, let's kinda see what we- what we can find. Uh, we have attempted twice now to hunt a moose calf and have failed. The first time was mainly because we just had really low health. The second time was because they were smart and stayed in the water on top of also being in uh the opposite territory which was crevice territory so had to abandon it abandon that hunt for that reason oh i hear hunting music i may be able to something run past me i didn't see it but yeah, I don't think we're gonna do like a full, full hunt. Just, yeah, try to find a calf or... A calf or something. Um, we can kind of check out the herd. Uh, see if maybe if we run into... A mom or something along the way. But we probably won't... Um, actively hunt the herd itself. Oh, there's a den right there. Oh, you know what? We might actually have to hunt the herd because the calves, yep, are grown up now and running with the rest of the herd. So we will, so crap, we're not gonna be able to carry that. I don't think. 
I think only mule deer fawns were able to carry now. I don't think we can carry the elk calves anymore. Yeah, I think they're too big. So... We need, um... We need fawns. Or a moose calf. These two ladies don't have any fawns. So yeah, so they're not gonna be hiding in the tall grass anymore. I mean, I still think some of them will be, but not as much as we are used to. Sorry guys, hold on. Okay. Okay, that's it's fine. Okay. Alright guys, sorry about that, we're back. Um, alright, so we were trying to find mule deer. Um, are these the mule deer we were just, that we just ran by? Probably. Because it's kind of heading back in that direction. So we know the elk herds are gonna have calves, but I just, I don't think we can carry them anymore. I think the only carryable carcasses are, um... Boost calves and fawns. Um, which speak of the devil? We have a mo moose calf here. Let's see if we're actually successful this time. Where's the mom at? There's the mom. And she's in front of the baby. Okay, stop. Let go. Back off. There's the mom. Come on, come on, let go. I'm pretty sure these are still carryable. She got stuck on a rock. Okay, let go. Running towards crevice territory. Oh, okay. Ah, crap, we're like right on the edge. some ring around the rosy here. I'm sure that noise is going to get annoying to you guys. I'm sorry. There's no way for me to really stop it. It's just we're right on the edge between crevice territory and our territory. Let go. They're running into crevice territory. 
That's okay as long as we can finish the hunt and get it out of here. How? Ooh, this is an active hex. This might be bad. Come on. Yes! And we, can, and we can pick it up. So now we can kind of just get out of here now. We didn't go too far into the territory, which is good. Alright, finally our first moose calf, guys. Finally, which is great because I don't think these guys would be around for much longer. So I'm glad we got one. Before they essentially, I guess, went out of season. So, we'll go ahead and bring this back. Uh, there's no territory you really need to mark or anything. So, we will uh, just kind of carry this back now. Um, since this is bigger than elk calf carcasses, this will probably last longer, which is great. And it will probably make them good and strong, too, which is what we want. So, yeah, they're all getting pretty, uh, pretty hungry now, so... It's just gonna take a little bit, because this calf is... Is heavy, so I don't think we have to cross any deep water. I think the only source of water that we might need to cross is the creek, but that's not deep enough to where we will drop end up dropping the carcass. So It's just... Let's see, how heavy... They're all at 19 pounds, so... These guys, they're growing up pretty fast. I think Fawn... No, Vulcan is probably gonna be the first one to reach 20 pounds. And... Sandstone will... Probably, uh, be one of the last ones. So it's probably gonna go Vulcan, Fauna, Aspen, and Venus. One of those, uh, both of those might hit 20 at the same time since they're at equal weight right now. And then it'll be Sandstone. So, since the passing of Reed, it kind of looks like now Sandstone has kind of become somewhat of the, the new runt of the litter since he is the, he's at least the lowest in weight, which is, that's what usually determines runts, not just always just necessarily the size, it's also the weight. He's just, he's, he's a big runt, that's what we'll call him, a big runt. Um, so, we're nearly there. The site is going to be up in the mountains, uh, kind of past these next uh, few hills here, and we'll be there, so... Add a stamina. We're nearly there. About uh, a hex or so away, so. We had to travel far for this moose calf. Yeah, we were. Yeah, we were by First Meadow when we found it, so. 
See, I tell you guys, first meta was a nice, uh, 